Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is Dave from DLLM Cactus. I have a cool little video tonight, but before we get started, I'd like to ask if anybody has the time to like and subscribe. It would help me uh, grow the channel, get this out to more people and uh, grow over time. So anybody that has the time, I really appreciate it. Um, tonight we have a video of this uh, Echinopsis uh, Rainbow Burst. It's a little cactus I call Googly Eyes. Um, I caught it at Lowe's. Uh, it had the little googly eyes uh, with the glue on top and it was covering up one of the pups but I, when I looked closer it had that variegated edge on it. It was a five dollar cactus so got home immediately took off those eyes. It didn't do anything any damage to the cactus and just took off one of the pups but uh, after a year and two months this is how much fun I've had. So it's growing well, it was outside. I think these pups are ready to come off as well, but leaving them on there, just letting them get ready for spring. And then these pups are the ones that I took off right away a year ago. They, uh, I put them in two and a half inch pots and had them rooted up. They were outside until it started to get colder. And then I had them upstairs in my loft under grow lights. So they've done really well, they're growing right now. And then I had about four of them that already had roots that I took off of the base, like really low down there to the soil line. And uh, those with the roots, I had two of them left here that spent the time out in the winter out in the greenhouse, the small little greenhouse out there. And they've done really well. They're ready to go. And then I gave one of them to my mother-in-law because she's the best. I mean, she's basically who inspired me to uh, kind of get into cactus. She has... The greenest thumb and her yard is so amazing with a uh, cactus and then one of my friends from work she loves to propagate plants so i definitely uh, gave her one so she could kind of play around with it as well so look on the back side here on um, two of them already have the variegation starting on the left on that one and in the center there so that's kind of cool and then about six months ago i took off some more pups and then started rooting them just in cactus soil with some uh, pebbles on the bottom. But uh, yeah, they spent time out in the winter. I kind of left them in the greenhouse, so I probably should have rooted them inside. But you can see that one's heavily variegated. And then that one has variegation starting on the side. But these guys did actually surprisingly well. When it was cold out, they still developed a pretty nice root system under them. So definitely, yeah, I can't even pull some of these. But uh, I'll definitely get these potted up in some uh, two and a half inch pots here in the next week or so. So I can get them growing for the spring. And then also, it actually had a bloom that was right above the variegation on the top right up there. And I pollinated that flower with another rainbow burst that I have out in the greenhouse. And I got seeds, developed a fruit, and these seeds... I want to say I did these, yeah, 722. So they're about eight months and two weeks. And uh, you can tell some of them are heavily variegated in the center. I mean, they have hardly any green, which the green will help them grow a little faster. The ones that don't have the variegation are a lot thicker. But I'd say there's like 50 in there. I was battling a little bit. I didn't microwave the soil. That was kind of before I knew that trick. So I had some... Uh, little moss and things growing in there that kind of battled with it. But a lot of the cactus in there, maybe like 50 or so. And then this one I did recently. This one was not recently, but 11, four. So yeah, about four months and two weeks. And they're growing really nice, not battling with anything in there too much. And then there's some definite variegation in those as well. So it's always fun to see how many will come out variegated and yeah. Just try to keep it going. I have, I think, another 100 seeds that I haven't even planted yet. So, yeah, I would say this uh, little $5 cactus here has been a lot of fun for me. So, yep, that's just the story of my cactus called Googly Eyes. Um, hope you liked the video. I'll try to get some more out later this week. But uh, thanks. We'll see you on the next one.